Hey everybody, today I'm going to be moving all of my non OT8 album cards for Stray Kids into this binder. So it'll be my Chen collection that was separate, and then the cards for Chungbin, Lino, Hyunjin, and Jungin are going to go in this binder. I don't know if it's going to fit them all well. We're going to give it, I guess, a test run and see. I need to find what like fillers I'm going to use. Okay, I moved my desk so I don't know how my lighting is. Story of my life. But let's get started. I'm just going to put all of the sleeves in. And then I'll take out or just leave in what I don't need. I think I calculated I need like 34 pages. But this binder is not going to grow. Like the only thing that's going to get added is like the missing cards that I left spots for. But it's not gonna have like any future comebacks in it. And I didn't want, cause I realistically for OT8, after either Max, either Maxident, sorry, I paused. I'm either gonna have to do from Maxident on in a different three, like big binder or whatever comes after Maxident will have to go in a different binder, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. So we'll have to see. I'm storing everything once again in my Kurami. I'm just gonna film a story and organizing, but I'm setting up for some more OT8 sets that you'll see as I go. So <laughs> I didn't, I'll just make that its own separate thing. Um, Chan is still gonna be separate and then I'll put the other four boys together. Eventually in the future, I think I'll probably end up doing way more older OT8 stuff, but I don't think I'll ever, I'm not gonna say ever. I don't plan on fully committing to OT8 for everything. Cause there are some albums that were really, really difficult. I'll talk about them when I get to them. That <laughs> trying to find Felix in them, some of the sets concerns me, which if I thought I could find Felix in, in the sets, I don't think I would be worried. I Am Who is one of them. <laughs> I don't want to deal. I don't know why I Am Who is like the difficult one. I need to figure out layouts. So that's also going to be a lot of this, me attempting. Do I want them? Yeah, we'll do that. But yeah, some of... Um, <laughs> It's gonna be me trying to figure out, oh, I like which ones go to that together the best for Chan. Um, I took out the doodle PC because this is a four pocket and I kind of want to still make sets because it's me as a human. Okay, I'm already really liking this. It is so sunny all of a sudden and it's funny because I filmed earlier and it was like pouring down rain and windy, like I thought. My window was gonna fly open. This is another one. I'm aware I have the I am you pre-order benefit that I could just put that here. But then I have to figure out what I would do with Chungbin and Felix, and I like them in my special binder. These might eventually end up being black fillers, but for right now, I like maybe i'll rotate black and pink depending on which one fits the theme better but like the pink goes with that on tamiro okay do i only have two for miro no how, how did yellow wood get here hmm Okay. I guess that works because they're in the same outfit. I'll probably end up doing the red set eventually. And that means I'll probably end up doing another yellow wood. So this will be a page together. I think that's the only reason this binder might change is if I pick different like filler colors, which I bought black business cards. They just haven't arrived. I 
think black would hollow would look really nice. And we have yellow wood. I need to see which goes together. Should I put the selfies together? Yeah. If by some miracle I got Trans Limited, it would go there for Miro. so weird the sun is now gone like i literally closed my my curtain because it got really sunny okay i ran out of japanese size sleeves when i was doing this so that was a struggle i'm not gonna lie i need to buy more but i have some popcorn ones coming in a go Okay, so I decided to do one more Levanter set so I would have four cards for Jan. And I'm aware that is a very dumb reason for me to be like, oh, I should do um I should do another set. Then it's then it makes four pocket. I just wanted the lenticular here. I'm gonna be really honest. And then the last page for Chan or my insanity when I thought, what if I collected, I double collected Chan for, for no easy. I don't, I don't think I'll do it for ordinary, but I might collect some extra cards for Chan for accident. but I also might store them in my room because I really, really love how the accident cards look. I think I kind of thought this one through when I was doing it. And that is my Chan. It didn't take up that much room. Like originally I contemplated, I have this on a pink, like a rose colored binder too. Cause I was like, oh Chan can have one. And the other boys can have one. But that would be barely anything in this binder. <laughs> This is one of the sets that eventually might be OT8 because I have, I have pawns in this. I feel like I could find Felix in. Mixtape is a terrible, the baby PCs for some of the boys are rough though. A mixtape. Mixtape isn't terrible. I am not the baby PCs are rough. Cause I would be worried about Felix. A couple of my friends have pulled Sungman a million times, so I feel like I could get Sungman. And same with Han. I feel like my friend Cheryl pulled Han a bunch. Jenna looks so cute here. I don't know how straight this is. <laughs> I guess the plus side of doing this is like I don't really need like the hollow fillers like I did for Chan because it's just four photo cards. I do have some like spot fillers though for missing cards. I have decided that I'm gonna do OT8 for go live. I'm not missing a ton of cards. I looked it up. I think I'm only missing, I'm missing three double-sided, which is okay. The worst part about me missing three double-sided is I have traded every single one of those for another card. Uh, the double-sided Sungmin I traded to get Orange Chan, I think. And then I traded Felix from that same double-sided set to get the other double-sided Chan. These black bordered I Am Who cards are so hard to collect. Like, I don't know why I Am Who people overcharge. Which I don't get because I think you get two or three cards. But I have Hyunjin and Jungin's. This will be the set if I collect I Am Who, it'll be the black ones. Because I actually really like Chan's on the black one. I think I'm only missing yellow border. 
the Kenchen. And I am who now. Okay, blue cards are so cute though. I like the yellow. I like the border ones. I'm not a fan of the concept ones, but I guess that's because I don't. Like the concept cards are normally my least favorite in general. But I'm missing the yellow borders for like all of them other than Jogan and Chan. I, yeah, obviously Chan. I have Chan complete. I still cannot believe when I was unboxing Maxident and I pulled every one of Chan's cards in two albums. He didn't like me in like the US pre order benefits though, which is sad. I feel like realistically I could do OT in these concept PCs. <laughs> And I wouldn't have to think twice about it. I feel like these are really easy to find. I feel like when I first started setting up my binders, like, and I guess filming it, I was really skeptical about when people would have four pocket binders. And I don't know why. I have so many now, and my goal is I'm trying to have less of the big binders because they just take up so much space. I watched Maria Honeydew Mochi on here convert most of her collections, except for like old ones, into four pocket binders, and I really love it. But I also see people on TikTok all the time who have their Stray Kids collections. In these binders, I will. I don't think I would ever move my OT8 binder. I'd move it to a different, like three inch, like three ring. But I don't. It would never. I don't think I would ever do. Like it would be. It would take up too many binders to do a four pocket. I do really want to get a six pocket one, like the wide beyond DA5 for ATs though. probably gonna be another short video but it's okay I'm saying that I looked I've been filming for 16 minutes oh, I finally finished this collection which makes me very happy this makes me very very happy this might be the cover photo or something from the Shan collection figure out what I want to be for the photo and my goal is to post this this week and then next week probably the storing and organizing that I'll film later but I'll have to see I have to get ready I have to go shopping for the holidays oh I got plenty of pages which makes me really happy I hope everybody's having a wonderful week how is everybody's collections going or how is everything going for everyone? I co-hosted another Stray Kids Cup Sleeve event yesterday. That was a lot of fun. It was Christmas Evil themed. I finally got a compass, a new insert for my Stray Kids light stick. It's like pastel pink and cloudy. I'll probably post that photo this week on Instagram. I want to say Leanne has this Lino for me. <laughs> Like, she pulled a really good Stray Kids album, and I think I'm just gonna buy the album off of her. She was trying to pull... I feel like she was trying to pull Hyunjin. I don't know how I feel about the paper bag colored, like, locker fillers right now. I'm gonna make those pink. Maybe tonight. I need to change some sleeves around. Some of my other binders, just little makeover things. Maybe I'll film it. I don't know. Because I want to change the size because I have some shorter ones for my Monsta X Beyond D. So I might just switch all my sleeves and just like chat because they announced to come back today. 
Oh, the black borders. I'm still trying to find Lido. Oh, I didn't realize I had the set complete. I think I knew, but I don't know why my brain didn't process it when I started putting it away right now. getting windy again. This weather is so weird. It's now cloudy and windy and it's raining where it was like sunny and I had to close my blinds. So who knows how the lighting will be for this video. I can't see super well from my filming angle. I love when he had pink hair for Levanter. He looked so cute. This was my torn set. I'm going to do the their photos with their names as an OT8 set, but that was one of my options that I really wanted to do. The gray border. I feel like I traded away that Felix with the name. I know I had to trade away some Felix stuff to finish my Chan collection. And I, I hate that I had to do it, but like, it was my only way. Cause I didn't want to buy a lot of stuff and I had gone literally until I think 2020 where I was just keeping what I pulled with stray kids. Like I loved Chan and I've built a Chan for like forever, but I like, I was so weird about, I didn't want to trade for him because I didn't trade with EXO. I kind of just kept what I pulled, but with Suho I would buy stuff and I was buying Chan stuff here and there, but I'm really glad I fully committed to collecting everything for Chan. It's miserable sometimes because of the amount of POVs, but I ultimately really love it because I'm so proud of this collection. But let's give this a little flip through. I really like this spread like a lot. Like to the point, this might be the photo for this. I love the, sh the shattered hollows in this. I don't know if they're coming up well on camera, but I think they'll look really cool with the black. Okay, I am so happy with this. I like when he does the little pouty bread face. The reason the Jungin baby photo has rounded corners, it's the only second press one. And we have the white I am who. did more signed backs because then I feel like their signatures only end up on POB cards or like the random uh, limited card for go live I wish I would have bought a second limited go live to get another card because I really want I want either Lino or Hyunjin or even Jenin I made a binder cover. I was hoping it was gonna be ready before I filmed this, um, but it's not ready for pickup. <laughs> and that is it. I think I'm gonna end up adding, I have the rest of Boys's skizus. I don't remember who made this art, like the cinnamon, not the cinnamon roll, who made the Sanrio skizoo stickers to save my life. Rochelle got it for me at a cup sleeve event and I don't remember who it was. But these were a gift from my friend. It was like the hearts, the hearts, cherries, and anything that's like this red color or this hot pink was a gift um, from my friend from, I think my birthday. She gave me really cute stickers. And then this compass is Stay Peachy Co. It's from the Alice in Wonderland themed sticker sheet. 
but yeah um i made a binder cover i'll show it to you guys at some point or another it'll show up in my collection update i'm gonna try to film that soon but this is officially my non ot8 album binder for stray kids um some parts might get taken out of this if i decide to collect ot8 sets we'll have to see how it goes thank you so much for watching you guys i hope everyone has a wonderful december and have a wonderful day or night wherever you are goodbye everyone Okay.